everybody, Tina here with Loving Life's Little Blessings and I just wanted to do a really quick product share for you guys. I got this bundle, um, I love these tags and bags. You guys know I use these boxes all the time for organizational stuff in my craft room, but then these bags are really great for gifts and stuff. And last year we had the Chevron bags and they look like this and they're super cute so this year the new bundle the new bags uh were these and they're polka dot and when i got my order the other day i had gone ahead and ordered the bundle you can save 15 percent by bundling the tags with any one of these three products so i went ahead and got the new bags and the accessory and tags so i wanted to open it up and show you guys what everything looked like before I put it all away in my craft room. Oops. Wrinkle that one. So here's the bags. I'll do something fun with these in a couple weeks. So those are the bags. And then here's the tags and the accessories. So first, I love these little clips, these colored clips. I'm actually gonna use one of these clips or maybe even two of them in my planner. Then there's this really thick white baker's twine. It's thick. Then there is, this is a sticker, these are stickers. And then there's these tags. And you can use these on cards too. And they're polka dot. So that is the tags and bag accessory. And we're having a real moment today. Um, I'm gonna do some filming with the tags um, bags, boxes, pretty packaging line that we have. But I wanted to share with you guys, this is the drawer that it's um, the fourth drawer down. So it's where, you know, my tools and stuff are here, my adhesive is here, that kind of thing. And I really wanted a drawer for my pretty packages stuff. Um, bags, clear boxes, you can see, but it's all just kind of been shoved in here and I'm tired of it. So I just got this brand new product. You can stay, watch the video all the way through and you'll see at the very end where I open up the this package of stuff and I share with you guys. But right now I'm going to organize this drawer and then I'll come back and I'll share with you guys how it turns out. All right, so this is what I came up with. This is uh, my baker's twine that's loose. Now you guys know that I keep baker's twine up here in this container right here. So I have like one of every color wrapped around the clothespins. And then extra baker's twine is kind of in here. Here's some loose baker's twine and I really need to just go through and wind some of this stuff back up. Um, you know that. And then I have some extra, like this is, um, probably t uh, t Tangerine Tango and we used to not have this in a big pack it came in the tag kit and so now we have it in the big pack and I have like a big package of it here that's what this Baker's Twine is right here so some of this just needs to be wound back up and then this is like extra like I have an early espresso one already up on top of my desk so you just need to kind of clean that up and I'll do that <clears throat> at some point and then my bags are in here and then underneath it is my boxes that aren't put together and then right here is the boxes and then their covers and then right there in the back those are all clear mount cases and then here's some crepe paper and then this is where I keep all the tags so you can just see that all the different tags and the clothes pins and all the accessories are just in there so that's what I decided to do there and I actually moved it up to the third drawer and then I moved all of this up one drawer this is non stampin up stamps that I use that I don't want to get rid of like my peachy keen stamps these are my pink stamper stamps and then all my re-inkers are in there 
and then some old Stampin' Up! ink pads because I never get rid of any of my colors. And then this bottom drawer is a mess. I'm not even going to show you guys. I'll organize it and show you guys another time. <laughs> so anyways, that's uh, a little bit of organizational for you guys today. Hi everybody, I just wanted to pop back right at the end of this video and just show you how I've used one of those little gift bags and the tags. This is, um, a couple weeks ago I showed you guys the cards that I colored with the blendabilities and they're the little flower cards with the background, um, dictionary background and I told you guys I was doing that for a hostess gift so I needed a way to package those and so I just took one of these bags and I took a piece of our Blackberry Bliss cardstock and I just wrapped it around like a little band just slides you can see it's not attached to the bag any and then I tied the bow with the Hello Honey ribbon and then I did this tag and then I just used and then when you open it up the cards are inside so there's the cards and the envelopes, and then I just folded down the top of it, and then I just used the little clip to clip that tag right to it. Just like that. So that's how the bags look. I just did some stamping and used a punch and uh, decorated it up, but that's, how the, that's one of the things that I've done with the bags. So thanks guys so much for coming by, and I'll talk to you later.